in this section of uh, biology we are going mainly to focus on the class insecta we have introduced the phylum anthropoda and we have seen the general characteristics of all organisms that we find in phylum anthropoda we have listed some of the classes which included class insecta class arachnida class diplopoda class chilopoda and class crustacea now we are going to focus mainly on class insecta and uh, under this class we have organisms like the bees butterflies mosquitoes we have the earwing the beetles we have the dragon flies we have the butterflies cricket termites and cicads grasshoppers and many other organisms now class insecta the organisms that we find in this class all of them have six legs that is they have two or three pairs of legs and their body parts are divided into three sections they have the head the thorax and the abdomen all organisms in class insecta they have four stage life cycles and others have three stage life cycles for example organisms like the butterflies they have a four stage life cycle where they have the egg, the larva, the pupa, and the adult. That is a four-stage life cycle. We last for organism like the cockroach. For them, they have a three life stage cycle where they have the eggs, the nymph, and the adults organisms that are in class insectors they excrete nitrogenous wastes in form of uric acid because uric acid requires less water and therefore it helps them to save a lot of water in their bodies in the process of breathing they have tubules which are called trachos and they use this system of the trachos for breathing in oxygen and breathing out carbon dioxide for excretion is carried out in the Malpighian tubules. They are the ones that are responsible for the excretion of waste materials from the body to the outside part of the organisms. And um, most of these organisms that are found in class insecta are terrestrial organisms that means that they live mainly on land and all organisms in this class they have compound eyes we have seen that class insecta 
is made up of very many organisms and they have three pairs of legs their body is divided into three sections the head the thorax and the abdomen we have seen that they have two stages or life cycle stages some have a four stage life cycle and others have a three stage life cycle we have seen that the breathing is carried out in the treacherous system and the excretion is carried out via the malpigian tubules. They have compound eyes and they are widely distributed and release nitrogenous wastes in form of uric acid. Next time when we come, we shall discuss about the phylum arachinida. And in phylum arachinida, that's where we shall look at the spiders, the teeth.